In today's video, I'm gonna show you what the top five designs are right now for print on demand. We're gonna make a new design. These designs are trending and it's what everyone is looking for right now. It's what's trending. So if you've been wanting to start your print on demand business and are in need of some designs, then make sure you watch this video all the way through because somewhere in it, I'm gonna give you a hashtag to comment down below so that way you can get access to five free designs. These are all high quality designs that you can use for your print on demand business. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure you watch all the way through. Not only that, but I'm also gonna give you throughout the video where you can source these designs. I know that not everybody knows how to design for themselves. Not everybody knows how to use Photoshop. You can use Canva, but remember, you need high quality designs. So the free account that you can get through Canva, you can't download high enough quality designs to use for print on demand, unfortunately. You would have to upgrade to their premium version. But most image services out there are gonna be like this. You are gonna have to sign up for one of their subscriptions in order to gain access to their high quality images or their high quality downloads. But again, don't worry because sometime throughout this video, I'm gonna drop that hashtag so you can get those free images. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So the first design we're gonna talk about is the In My Era design. Right now, everybody is in their era. I'm in my toddler parent era. I'm also in my photographer era. I'm also in my dropshipping era. I'm also in my print on demand era. I'm also in my everything hurts era. Oh, my back. So there's literally an era for absolutely everything. And the designs are super simple. So check this out. Let's just run over to Etsy.com really fast. And we're going to look up In My Era design. So if you start to look through some of these, you're gonna find all of these different options. Now, one thing that's significant about the In My Era design is this little wavy text. So you can see that each layer actually waves on top of the other one, and they kind of stack up on top of each other. So it's actually very aesthetically pleasing. It looks clean and it looks pretty good. And as you can tell, this can be customized for pretty much anything. So in my crafting era, in my dropshipping era, in my boy mom era. Actually, I think there isn't in my boy mom era. Right, there you go. I was looking through some of these because I was looking to actually purchase some of these so I can stick them with my prints on the man store. But if you have something that you want to say, so if you don't want it to say in my boy mom era, then you can do one of these that say in my custom era. Some of these you're going to be able to customize yourself, while others you're going to send the seller what you wanted to say and they'll make it for you. But let's just look up what is currently trending for in my era. So let's look up t-shirts in my era t-shirts. We're not looking for the designs. We're looking for... All right, so they're doing custom shirts. So you do have in my era with custom text on the actual t-shirts. Here's one that's actually doing really good. This is a design, but in my IDGAF era, in my I don't give a can't say that on YouTube era. So this store has 5.2 thousand reviews and the design itself only costs $1. It's not bad, but let's look up an actual shirt really fast. So let's look up something specific. So in my mom era, a lot of moms are going to be looking at these shirts. These are huge hitters with moms. So in my mom era, and as you can see, there's a few different styles. So a few different colors. Again, when you purchase your design, you're going to have the option to choose from a few different ones, or you can also have the option to request specific colors or specific texts. But here you see that there's also a few in my mom era designs. You have this one over here. This one actually looks pretty cool. All right, here's an actual sweater. So this one's 2275 and it's a simple in my mom era. The reason I don't see too many of these on my end is because I actually look up a lot of designs on Etsy. Etsy is a great place to source your designs. They always have high quality options and they have some very unique ones as well. And the best part is, is you're working with small businesses. So you're helping support small business. And in return, you're also getting some really good customer service. All right, number two, IDGAF designs. Now these are a bit explicit. You can't really say them out loud, but that's why it's IDGAF, I don't give a F. So looking through some of the ones that they have available, this one's only just under $4 and the store itself has 426 reviews. Reviews for this item, it actually has eight and it has pretty good reviews. So this is really all it is, feeling kinda IDGAF-ish today. It's a simple design, there's not much to it. And that's one thing about best sellers and when it comes to designing, people love simplicity. They love things to be simple, they love things to be easily legible, some people do like extremely cluttered and colorful images, but other people like to be minimalistic. So it's good to be able to offer a little bit for both types of demographics. So IDGAF designs, there's a ton of different ones. Look at this one right here. This one's perfect for tumblers. So it's the same concept as the last one, feeling kind of IDGAF-ish. And it's just a bunch of skeleton middle fingers around the tumbler. That's all it is. The design itself costs $1. It'll cost you, I think, about 14 to 15. Actually, let's confirm. Then a tumbler will cost you about $14. So $15 total 
total production cost. Then as far as selling it, you can sell a tumbler on Etsy easily for $30 to $40, depending on the size. A 20 ounce normally runs about $30. At least that's what I sell them for. So you can make a nice profit of 15 bucks. And then just looking through a few more, you can see that in my IDGAF era again. And you have a few others. So most of these are pretty simple. As you can tell, a lot of these are very just black and white and just plain text. All right, up next at number three, we have holiday designs. Now, holiday designs are extremely popular. And of course, during each holiday, a few months prior, maybe one to two months before, that's when they really start picking up. So that's when you want to start listing them. Now, I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret. So my best seller for the holidays has been hands down St. Patrick's Day. And there's one design in particular. It's a leprechaun throwing up a rainbow holding a beer next to a pot of gold. For about three or four years in a row, every single St. Patrick's Day, about one to two months prior, that design starts picking up like crazy. People start buying tons of shirts with it. So let me show you how you can create one. Now for this, we are going to use AI. So we're going to be using Kittle. Now with Kittle, there is a subscription fee. Remember, like I said earlier, when you use these websites that help you out with designing or they give you the image resources, you are going to have to pay their premium prices in order to gain access to their high quality images. Now, the good thing about Kittle is that it's actually really cheap. So it's only $15 a month and you have access to their AI system, which is actually really, really good. Check this out. So right now we're over at Kittle. We're going to go to tools and AI image generator. Now we're under Kittle AI. So here, what we're going to do is we're going to tell it what we want. Now I want a leprechaun puking a rainbow, holding a beer, bending over next to a pot of gold in a green meadow. All right. So that's going to be our prompt. Now, as far as the image style, when it comes to Kittle, I always use their cartoon style simply because it doesn't have backgrounds or it'll give you the design by itself without an overly complicated background without a border. So let's click on cartoon and generate image. All right. So Kittle AI did its thing. And this is what it came out with. This is interesting. I don't know why it's grabbing his own puke. It's turning it into gold. This is actually pretty cool. I kind of like it, but let's make one more and let's add a distressed face. All right. So for some reason, when I put a distressed face, it gave me an error. So I changed it to a worried face and this is what it came up with. And I think this is the one I think this looks good. I like it. So this is going to be the one that we go with. So if you want access to this design along with a few other ones, now's the time that I'm going to give you that hashtag. So go ahead and comment down below the hashtag POD designs and let me know which one of these is your favorite. Which one's going to be the first one that you upload? The reason I say the first one is because you should upload all of the ones that I'm going to give you. So let me know down in the comments below which one's going to be the first one along with the hashtag POD designs and I'll send you a link with all of the different files. All right, number four, birthday designs. The best thing about birthday designs is that people tend to buy these in multiple quantities. When you offer a birthday shirt, you're going to be offering birthday boy turns five or something along those lines. But I highly suggest that you also offer other shirts that go along with it. So mom of the birthday boy, dad of the birthday boy, godmother of the birthday boy, grandma, auntie, uncle, cousin, best friend, brother, sister, anything that you can think of because people purchase these in sets. And trust me, I'm talking with experience. Nobody's ever going to buy just one. They're going to buy for the most part. It's going to be the birthday kid. It's going to be one of the parents or both of the parents and somebody else from the family, whether that be the aunt, uncle or one of the grandmas. Typically, at a minimum, I've always gotten three. So looking through Etsy, you can see that there's a few different types of designs. So most of these are going to be for just one person. They're not really as sets. But if you keep scrolling down, you're going to find a few more. So let's look up family birthday shirts PNG. And remember, we always want to go with a PNG image. We never want to go with JPGs or JPEGs. And there we go. This is what I was talking about. So we want to stay away from these because for one, they're copyright. We can't be selling these. And two, most print on demand providers won't even print these. So let's look at this one right here. This is perfect. This is for the birthday girl. It has birthday princess, mom or the birthday princess, dad of the birthday princess, godmother, brother, grandma, grandpa, godfather. As you can see, there's one for almost everybody in the family. Look for a few more. And here you have another one birthday girl. So this would cater more for an artist. So let's say the birthday girl or the birthday boy love drawing, painting or coloring. This is going to be something that the parents look for. Let's check out one more really fast. Let's see what there is. Oh, right here. This one's perfect. Mom of the birthday boy, the birthday boy, dad of the birthday boy, all with the in my era style text, which is the groovy 70s style with the curves. Okay, last but not least, at number five, we have vacation shirt designs. So when people go on vacation, they love to let everybody know that one, they're going on vacation, two, they're in that vacation as a family, or three, when they get to their destination, they like to let everybody know that they're tourists. As of right now, I am a tourist. <laughs> so these are the types of designs that you're going to be looking to sell these kinds of people. As you can tell, Etsy is probably one of my main places to get designs because you can buy single ones 
But here you have this one, today's forecast, tropical with a chance of drinking. That is absolutely perfect. This is perfect for people that are gonna go vacation on islands, on a cruise, they're gonna take a cruise around, maybe a yacht, we be tripping. This one's perfect for couples. So you can sell this as a couple set. You can sell a blue and a pink one or two white or two black shirts, one with a blue and one with a pink for the wife and the husband. Straight tripping. Actually, this one's really cool. I like that one a lot. Now let's look up family vacation shirts because just like for birthdays, families are going to go on vacation and they like to wear matching shirts. So this one right here is actually probably one of my favorite ones. Wow, this one's really nice. Family crews making memories together. This is perfect. And this doesn't even need any sort of customizing. You can just sell this same one and people will buy like seven or eight of them. All right here, bundle. I like this bundle. If you can find a bundle with the types of designs that you're looking for, even better. Bundles are awesome. And this one's actually really good. This one has a ton of different designs. So it has the Family Vacation 2024, Family Vacation Mexico, Family Vacation 24, Punta Cana, Hawaii. This is another great set because it brings 20 PNGs for only $3. And those were the top designs that you can sell for your print on demand business. Now, where are you going to be uploading these designs to? Well, simple. If you have an account with AutoDS, then you have access to not only the best dropshipping products, but also some of the best print on demand items that you can offer your customers. Now, if you don't have an account, then what are you waiting for? You're missing out on an extremely powerful platform to help you start and scale your business. Now, if you're on the fence about checking us out, then just check us out through our trial. You can get two weeks for just one dollar and once you sign on these are the products that you're going to have access to that are all fully customizable for your print on demand business check this out so you have your basic t-shirts you know like all other platforms you're gonna have your t-shirts you're gonna have your onesies your hoodies your sweaters some for men some for women i highly suggest you get into cropped by the way crop t-shirts and crop sweaters are huge hitters but if you keep scrolling you're going to find a lot more items so you're going to find some hoodies that you can actually print on the entire thing so you're not limited to just the front or the back you can print on whatever part that you want the hood the sleeves the bottom just the left just the right whatever it is you also have a couple of other cool things like this double fleece cloak i absolutely love these i actually have one myself then you also have some home and living as well so these are pretty unique you have things like rugs garden flags some mats for the outside and you can even customize bedding how crazy is that aside from that though there's tons of other things that you can print on such as phone cases shoes which i think is actually really cool shorts cups and a lot more so what did you think of this video let me know down in the comments below your thoughts what do you think about print on demand what do you think about auto ds in the print on demand business remember if you want access to those five free designs all you have to do is comment down below hashtag pod designs and let me know which one of these categories is going to be the first one that you upload huge thank you to for watching especially if you made it all the way to the end if you did make it this far like i always say that means you enjoyed the video so make sure you smash that like button hit that subscribe button ring that little bell notification and with that my name is mario with AutoDS, and i'll catch you all next time